It's been over two weeks since 23 year old Sergeant Ryan Canals gave his life for our country. Canals is one of 13 service members killed in the bombing at the Afghanistan airport. The soldier's funeral was this evening. 10 News reporter Caitlin Keenahan shows us how the community is responding to Sergeant Canals' ultimate sacrifice. People coming together, lining the streets of Tazewell Pike for this moment of silence. That was the procession for Sergeant Ryan Knaus, which brought him from the funeral home to his alma mater, Gibbs High School. There were hundreds of people out here. It was amazing. A way for the community to say thank you to a true American hero. We are so thankful for him and all the men and women that do that for us. Sergeant Knaus paid the ultimate sacrifice at the age of 23. He was one of the American soldiers who died in the bombing at the Afghanistan airport last month. It just was a very emotional time for me. Um, I have a son that is a little bit younger than him, and so it just kind of hit home. Knaus joined the military right after graduating high school. My son graduated Gibbs High School, and my son's 19, and it just really hits home. That's where the family held the sergeant's public memorial ceremony. He was the best of us. Their community members heard stories of Knaus's courage and commitment to fight for our freedoms. I'm a Vietnam vet, and so there's a lot of emotional attachment to that as well. The bleachers, full of people, full of thanks. I just want to thank him um, for giving the ultimate sacrifice, for his dedication, and just prayers for the family. I just hope that the family knows how much we love him for doing what he did and just how much we want to be there for them in their grief in this difficult time for them. That was Caitlin Keenahan reporting. After the public memorial service, Canals laid in repose inside the Gibbs Gymnasium. Community members could pay their respects to the fallen hero and honor his family.